In this video, we will show you how to integrate PagerDuty with AWS Security Hub. In PagerDuty, choose a service to configure the integration on. In this example, we'll use AWS Security Alerts as the service. Click on the Integrations tab. Enter a name for the integration. For the integration type, select the bullet to select a tool and choose AWS Security Hub from the drop-down menu. Click Add Integration. Under the Actions menu, select View to copy the integration URL into your clipboard or notes for later use. Go to AWS and log in to the AWS console. Go to Services. Search and go to Cloud Formation. You'll arrive at the Stacks page. Click Create Stack to create a new stack. Specify a template to use. For example, let's take a template from PagerDuty's GitHub repository. Click on Upload a Template File. Click to choose the file. Click Next. Specify stack details by entering a stack name like PagerDuty Security Hub Stack. Copy the Event Pattern parameter from the Integration Guide. Paste it into the Event Pattern parameter field. Copy the PagerDuty integration URL that you copied earlier to your clipboard or notes into the PagerDuty Events Endpoint field. It will serve as the PagerDuty Events URL. You can add tags if you would like to, but it's not required, so click Next. Scroll down and click Create Stack. While the creation is in progress, the following will occur and may take a brief moment to complete. Creation of new topic, URL endpoint registration, new CloudWatch event rule. Now, let's verify and conduct a simple test of the integration workflow. Let's go to Guard Duty since it plugs into Security Hub to generate findings. Go to Services. Search for Guard Duty and select it. Go to Settings to generate sample findings. Scroll down to the Sample Findings section and click Generate Sample Findings. Go back to PagerDuty to see the sample findings that triggered events in PagerDuty. You can return to the service configuration for AWS security alerts by clicking on the link to the service. It may take a few moments before the incidents are generated since they need to pass through from Guard Duty to Security Hub before triggering in PagerDuty. Alternatively, let's conduct another test and use a custom action to send a security finding to PagerDuty. Go back to AWS Security Hub. Go to Settings in Security Hub. Click on the Custom Actions tab. Enter a name like Custom SH2PD, which can also serve as the Custom Action ID. So, I'll copy and paste the action name into the Custom Action ID field. Enter Description. Click Create Custom Action. Now that we have a Custom Action ARN, copy it so that we can set up a rule for when a custom action happens. Go to CloudWatch by clicking on Services, then search for CloudWatch to select it. To create a new rule, click on Rules in the left navigation under Events. Click Create Rule. Look up Security Hub as the service name. Click Edit to copy in a customized event pattern to match on. If the source is Security Hub, if there's a custom action as the detail type, and it also matches this ARN, you'll notice the custom action ARN from before. Click to save the event pattern. Next, target an SNS topic and select SH Finding Topic from the menu. Click Configure Details to configure the rule details. Enter a name like Custom to PD. Click Create Rule. Return to Security Hub. Go to Services. Search for Security Hub and select it. Go to Findings on the left navigation. If you want to do a custom one, let's map from Guard Duty. I'll choose this finding to trigger an event in PagerDuty by selecting it and then clicking on the Actions menu to select Custom Security Hub to PagerDuty. Return to PagerDuty to see that once CloudWatch picks that up, it will trigger the alert back to PagerDuty right here. That completes the test of the PagerDuty AWS Security Hub integration. This concludes how to install, configure, and test the PagerDuty AWS Security Hub integration. For more information, please visit the integration page. You can also visit the integration guide available in our knowledge base to learn more.